I'm Lucy, I make videos for GameSpot, and I've never really played Zelda, it's like my dirty little secret. Uh, I'm aware of a lot of things, you know, like who Zelda is, who Link is, all that stuff. So Kate has presented me with the challenge of trying to guess what these various Zelda items are and what they do, and I'm really nervous. That makes you fly. No, it makes baby chickens follow you. Why would you want that? Uh, does it make rabbits follow you? Does it make tadpoles follow you? Does it... I don't know, make an indigenous tribe of people follow you? Like sheep? They're not all about following, I'm just going to uh -oh. give you that clue. <laughs> oh, do you like wave it at things and you say, leave me alone? <laughs> Absolutely dead room. <laughs> Are they bells? Coins? Shiny rocks? A crown? No. Goatsy. Oh, well, hang on, no! That was in Major Majora's Mask and it's, it's just a stick. It looks like, um, like a willy warmer. Oh, hang on, no, no. If you collect enough of those, do you get a Deku nut? No. See, I know what a Deku nut is. Well, you didn't earlier. I don't know, but I think Gaston wore it in Beauty and the Beast. Yes, it's the Gaston tunic. <laughs> Does that make you a jerk? Uh, that looks like a promotional item that got given away with Saints Row 3. What a gag, I don't know. A horseshoe? Combine your two answers. A ball gag in a shoe? <laughs> Does it turn you into a pig? But why? To gain the pig's trust. <laughs> Is Link into some kinky stuff? I don't know. I think I've seen that on some websites. It's just a really phallic looking unicorn horn thing. It's a special stick for conducting the wind. Admittedly, this hasn't made me want to play Zelda. Oh. I do want to play Akami again. Look how mad Lucy is. <laughs>